Supposing you want to capture an image that you're seeing on the web or your entire desktop and turn it into a static image that you can send to someone in an email or reference later yourself for personal use, here's the easiest way I've found to do it. You go up here to your start menu, you go down to the search all programs, and you type in snipping, S-N-I-P-P-I-N-G, and the first result is the snipping tool. This is built in by Microsoft to Windows 7 and it's extremely handy. Once you turn it on, your whole screen goes white and that's to show you that it's actually in the process of being ready to record. Let's say we just want to capture the one web page. We hold down the left mouse button as we use our cursor to drag it capture the entire area we want. That's it. We're done. Now, if we want to save it, we go to Save, Save As, and it will give you the choices of Portable Network Graphic, Ping, GIF, or JPEG, and I prefer JPEGs. And we're going to call it Screenshot 1. and you'll notice that it's being saved to the desktop for convenient access. We hit save, we're done. Now we go back here, if we want to get the whole desktop, everything that's on your monitor, we go here, we select new, and now we left click and drag, and we get everything that's on the monitor screen. Again, we go to file, save as, it's still set to JPEG from the last time, and we'll call it um, Screenshot Full View. Tidy it up just a little. And again, we're saving it to the desktop, since that's where we sent it last time. and we can close the snipping tool. And that's all you have to do to make screenshots using the snipping tool in Windows 7. I hope this has been helpful. Thank you and I look forward to having you visit again.